day has finally come. It's time to check in on my 30-day goals. Hey, Daphne here. Welcome to day 34 of Raising My Manifesting Vibration to Get What I Want. And if you're wondering how it's day 34, but I'm just reaching my 30-day goals today, well, it's really simple. I started the challenge, and then four days after, that's when I made my goals. So I set my goals from the day that I made them as far as 30 days later rather than backdating them because I wanted to make sure that I had the full amount of time set for them. So I have some really, really awesome stuff to report. And I have a really big thing, um, which is my, manif my level of consciousness, my level of vibration. And I'm going to save that for last. But it, whew, you will be excited to hear what it is. So let's kind of go over the day. Today was had been mostly an uneventful day. Oh, you know what? Let me break out my book here, my calendar, where I write down all of my manifestations, which is really important for me to be able to go back and look at what I did. Um, and on any day to see that I really am manifesting stuff every single day, literally every day, no matter how little. Remember, it's the small things. All right. So I was able to meet three of my 30-day goals, which I'm really, really proud of. Um, you know, some of the other ones, as the month went along, just became obsolete. They were no longer goals that I needed to accomplish just because my life's taking a different turn and that's totally okay. I'm not going to beat myself up over goals I didn't make when they weren't goals I needed to focus on anymore. So it's not a big deal. I was able to reach three of them, which is really awesome, and raise my vibration or my level of consciousness, which is a huge, huge, awesome, awesome step. So um, I actually... Um, have a freelance work at home position on the horizon here. So I'm really excited about that because it allowed me the opportunity to work from home but also contribute to a big project and it seems like it is very very likely that I will get on there as um, you kinda have to bid for the job and my bid was too high but the co-owner of the or co-founder of the website um, or this project personally emailed me and said hey we really want you we just need to lower we need you to lower our, your bid and I'm totally okay with that because they that means they already have me on their radar and this project pays out bonuses based off of my work and I know my work will be awesome so this will just make them feel more inclined to give me a little bit more money right so um, Let's see. Okay. One more thing and then I'll get to my level of consciousness. So to celebrate, we went out to dinner to the Olive Garden. We had some gift cards from Christmas that we hadn't used. So we decided to go to dinner for uh, tonight. So we have dinner and um, our two-year-old started to not feel good. So we took him out to the car. My husband did. And so I'm waiting for the check, and I put the, you know, get the check, put the gift cards in there and everything, and she comes back and tells me that um, there were two, two $25 gift cards. She tells me that one of the gift cards didn't scan, and that it just didn't get activated. I'm not, you know, and I wasn't prepared to, you know, sp spend anything, so I just, you know, or just spend a minimal amount of money. Um, so I didn't have really anything else with me, just to, just enough to pay the difference. And so I asked her, I said, hey, whew, another long day, lots of stuff going on, remember? So I said, well, hey, can you go talk to your, um, you know, your, or I said, is there anything that we can do about this? Because they're brand new, I haven't used them, I got them both for Christmas, so, you know, I don't have the receipts or anything. And she said, well, let me go talk to my manager. And it took a little while, but I wasn't worried. I sent a text to my husband, let him know it was going to be a little bit, um, another minute because of the situation. And 
after a few more minutes, I don't know, I probably waited five or ten minutes, uh, the manager comes over and first thing he does is he apologizes uh, that it took so long. And then he tells me, well, I'm not sure exactly what it was that happened with the gift card, so I just created a new one and ran it through, so you're good. <laughs> so uh, I went from the server telling me that I'm here I am going to have to pay the difference to the manager saying, nah, don't even worry about it. I don't know what happened. It doesn't even matter. You're good. So that that's money manifested technically because that card didn't have anything on it. Mm. Oh. Okay. So, oh, and if you, uh, I'm sure you've noticed by now, hair and makeup done make me feel beautiful. All right, I try told you guys I try to keep these videos short and here we are nearing six minutes so I'm gonna let you go while uh, after I let you know what my level of consciousness is and you can have a good night and I'll see you on my day 35 video tomorrow so without further ado my level of consciousness was at 417 remember it was I have to go back and find exactly which video that was, but it was at least two weeks ago, ten days, uh, ten to fourteen days ago. It was at four seventeen. Well, today I muscle tested it, and I am at four fifty four. Nearly, it's a thirty seven point raise in just a couple of short weeks. So that confirms that I am absolutely on the right track and the right path. So. Here we go. Video's too long. Sorry. Thanks for sticking with me. I'll see you tomorrow and have a great night.